Don't you just love that sound? Can you make the M1 Garand tactical? Um, I believe it's always been. Uh, it's undeniable effective in battle. Um, with a couple of additions, I think it could be even more effective. This is the M1 Garand. It shoots a heavy 30 uh, 6 round. Um, with this simple pouch, I've added storage for two end block clips, holding eight rounds each. So there's 16 rounds stored on the stock with another eight loaded to the rifle. I've got 24 rounds of 30 odd six before I have to dig for a reload. Um, and I'm gonna show you some gear to make that reload a little bit quicker, a little bit easier. What I'm wearing is 1980s era Alice gear. Um, you have the two ammo pouches, you have the ammo belt, the uh, H suspenders. This holds, holds the belt up so you can support some of the weight of the belt with your shoulders. And like I said, I have two, two ammo pouches. These are designed to hold three 30 round magazines for the M16 or AR15. Behind the right, I've got a canteen. Behind the left, I've got another canteen. I've got a couple of small utility pouches and I've got a place for my bayonet. So I can pull my bayonet out. So on my Alice harness, I've got two magazine pouches, two canteens, two utility pouches, and it's kind of supportive, it's kind of comfortable. Let's put it that way. So I've got plenty of ammo now for my M1 Garand. These are magazine pouches, and like I said, they're designed for the AR-15 or the M16 to hold three 30-round magazines. Um, these have Alice clips on the back, and they clipped right onto that, that web belt that I was uh, wearing. They have a quick opener, and inside you'd have three 30-round magazines for the AR-15 or the M M16 as it was for the military. I have a couple of cardboard spacers in there to keep them from rattling around and keep them getting scratched up or banged around when I'm running around. But what I found is this same pouch could very easily hold clips for the M1 Garand. By laying them in horizontally, I'm able to stack one on top of the other. And as you shoot one, you'd reach in and grab another. Um, I could hold eight, eight magazines in this uh, pouch. So I've got eight, eight round clips, do the math, 64 rounds per pouch. So I've got 128 rounds on my belt, plus the additional 24 rounds I had on the rifle. Um, the cool thing, what makes the M1 Garand so tactical, is I never have to eject an empty magazine. That ping you heard, that's the old clip. So as soon as that one pings out, I grab a new one, stick a new one in. Easy, quick reloads. Um, and I don't have to feed it up from the bottom so I can shoot prone. Um, kind of an advantage there. Uh, but if you're running around in the woods and the zombies are chasing you, get these at your local army surplus. They're not that expensive. Um, and they'll hold eight, eight round end block clips. When the zombies come, and they are coming, um, I've got 152 rounds on the rifle and on my person wearing that Alice gear. So I can take 152 zombies out before I need to get into my backpack for uh, more ammo. Um, not exactly tactical, but a great way to carry a lot of ammo for a great old rifle. Just had to hear it one more time.